So, because we're never going to get to play whatever we want again, we wanted to play some more covers, but none of those guys really wanted to sing them. So, we're going to take a vote. We want to play one more, one more cover without a real singer. So, the first option is going to be two of our, it's two of our favorite bands ever. Okay, probably yours too. We got we got Deftones, Be Quiet, and Drive. On this hand, okay. When we played that last night, and it was nerve wracking, but apparently, shit was fire. Or we could play Jimmy Eat World, Lucky Denver Mint, the greatest song ever. You're only booing because you love it. You know all the lyrics, Mr. Booer. All right, so one more time. Right, left hand, Deftones. Right hand, Jimmy Eat World. Wow. Hey, last night, last night for Jimmy Eat World, crickets. Crickets. We ain't got time. I was sad. I want to. All right, we're wasting time right we're now. We're wasting time. All right, we're going to play a song called Lucky Diver Mint by Jimmy Eat World. Oh, wait, I'm in the wrong guitar. Who's going to switch guitars? And we're going to, um, Bo and I are going to sing it as well as you guys are going to sing it. And we're going to get through it because you know what? We can. I, I even had the other guitar on because I thought Deftones was going to win by a landslide again. I'm so excited right now. You know, it's, a, you know, it's ironic because when I joined the band, I was like, uh, you know, Deftones is my favorite band in the world. All my passwords are Deftones. Boo! Not a big Deftones fan. At the time! At the time. It's okay. You gotta remember, I was 19, it was the gift music, I thought it was the best thing in the universe. You know what was, was rad though? Last night when Deftones got picked, all about it. Yeah, we were stoked. Okay. Uh, this song is uh, Jimmy Eat World.
Hey, I, Jade, singing's hard. You know, Jade, uh, Jade is my, uh, my beautiful better half, and she always wants me to sing for her, but I hate singing. So, that singing is the second hardest thing next to childbirth. Yep, childbirth, singing. Then being a singer, then trying to command respect as a bass player, fourth hardest thing. So I just did all four, I did three things. I haven't, I haven't done the one thing. Maybe. Are we, uh, are we doing that? Yeah, okay. So, short history. Short, boring history of the band. Anybody from Corona? I.E.? Anybody go to Showcase Theater? I grew up at Showcase Theater. I, I, I'm from Corona. 909, baby, not 951. 909. OG. Famous Stars and Straps, baby. So, I went to Showcase in 99, 2000 or so, and I saw a band play uh, that was called Open Hand. And that band contained Alex Rodriguez on drums, Bo Burchell on guitar, and Mr. Zach Kennedy on bass. And, uh, and uh, that was my first introduction to Open Hand, and I didn't know any of these guys at the time, but I loved that. Uh, there was like an EP they put out, and I loved it. I loved Alex's drumming. They had like lamps on stage, it was weird. Anyways, so, so a lot of, uh, when Bo was in Open Hand, he wrote a lot of what became Seos and songs. And so, we wanted to play an Open Hand song tonight with uh, Justin Isham, who's the guitar player. He couldn't make it due to scheduling. I think he's a dad. I don't think he's a dad. He's not a dad. He couldn't make it. We still want to play it, so we're going to play it, and you can hopefully understand kind of where Seosin came from in these songs. And so we're going to play that track right now. And Zach, Zach is the first bass player of Seosin. <laughs> and on that uh, on that last song, I may not have sounded like it, but I felt like Jim Atkins. It was amazing for like three minutes. It was amazing. <laughs> This song is awesome. Well, in your eyes by Open Hand. Um, you know what I mean? It's hard. Six strings, I don't know how to do it. All these cover songs and all these different tunings, it's wild. Okay, here we go. This is open hand in your eyes.
That was awesome.